if I knew it was my last day of high school, I was gonna go thank every teacher um, just for just being there for me and everything they've done for me. And especially my coaches, because they shaped me to be the person I am today. Ever since the coronavirus struck the United States, many senior events, seasons, and even school years have gotten canceled, leaving many students full of regret and disappointment. We caught up with a couple other Staley students in administration to see how this pandemic has affected them. I think the kids, there, there is a little added pressure um, because they're working at a, in a different space, you know, a different way of doing things. And, you know, if you're at school, you can walk across the hallway and go see a teacher. And now you have to email them or try to Zoom conference with them, things like that, right? So those are a little bit different. I'd say the younger ones are affected by it just because they don't have any way of like contacting their friends and stuff like that. I mean, like us older kids still have ways to contact their friends. Like we can get on PS4 with each other, all that type of stuff. Although this situation has affected families, communities, and spring sports in a numerous amount of ways, many have found positive outlooks on this situation. I'd say some of the pros are like being able to work at your own pace. Uh, a lot of like the teachers have been good about like making sure you're not like bored or like just stagnating and also obviously like sleep in so like my day more like conforms to my sleep schedule e-school is very easy it's a lot easier than high school because i mean everything is just right here right in front of you and you just do it as you please um they give you a due date usually and that's when you do it and it's just really easy however are the positives of e-learning really worth the cost of limited interaction, postponed spring sports, and possibly no graduation? I personally would rather have it be in the classroom because I'm a very hands-on learner and I'd want to, you know, be with the teacher in the classroom learning, you know, the subject that we're learning. Trying to get a hold of people sometimes is difficult, um, but uh, we're, we're trying uh, the best we can and, and trying to maintain that positive uh, piece. but but I do miss the daily interactions. Without school and sports, students have no way of communicating face-to-face. -face. So, how are students attempting to fill this void? My PS4, honestly, it's the only way I can talk to the guys. I mean, like, still connect with my friends in certain ways, but I'm just more careful about it. I'm nowhere in my wrongs, my rights, because I mean, the virus is big, but I feel like if you're smart about it, then you shouldn't have any problems with doing stuff like on a normal day being able to exercise more like throughout the day, even though it's not going out to a gym or something like that, just home stuff. But the only thing keeping me sane is just video games. I, you know, I get, even though it's not physical, me and my friends, you know, we play the uh, PlayStation all day and we get to interact with each other. From PS4 chats to exercising to Zoom calls, students are trying their best to stay calm and connected during these tough times. Signing off for Bird's Eye View, this has been Kalena, Gracie, and Allie.